Welcome to the March 2019 edition of the MSOL Priority Report. This month we'll highlight our successful CUNA GAC, the progress we made there, the progress we're making with the launch of the Open Your Eyes Awareness Campaign, and provide you with some updates on CUSG's new directions. So first of all, with advocacy, uh, well, another CUNA GAC is now behind us. Over 130 Michigan Credit Union Advocates joined a total of 5,300 strong in our nation's capital. In addition to the lobbying efforts, there were numerous great speakers and lots of networking opportunities. While in D.C., we talked about issues that you're familiar with, uh, promoting the credit union difference and why we need to preserve our not-for-profit tax status data security and privacy, putting more responsibility on merchants, cannabis banking, um, providing for a safe harbor so that credit unions and banks can bank those legal businesses, and letting Congress know that we're in the early stages of looking for updates to the Federal Credit Union Act. One more, housing finance reform. And by the way, we got some good news while in Washington that uh, Senator Elizabeth Warren has agreed to take out the provision that would have subjected credit unions to CRA in her version of housing finance reform. So this week in DC provided an excellent opportunity to educate members of our delegation, particularly our four new freshman members and their staff on the credit union difference and on these issues. And I wanna thank the incredible 130 advocates from our state who showed up strong in Washington and hopefully they all had a great time being a part of an important process. Now on the state side, we're also working on data breach legislation a new bill introduced uh, will uh, provide for a 45-day notification window in which merchants who have experienced a breach would have to provide that notification. We'll continue to work that issue in Lansing as well as in Washington, D.C. On the regulatory front, our team has met with representatives of the CFPB to discuss payday lending, HMDA, and the Bureau's rulemaking under the new leadership. Additionally, we had a great meeting with Board Chairman McWatters of the NCUA to discuss a handful of issues, including their concerns over the FASB uh, CECL uh, model and how the NCUA is working to assist credit unions with implementation. We also spent quality time with our new DIFS Credit Union Division Director, Denise Schulteis, in Washington. So the GAC was productive on the regulatory front as well. Now, let me update you on the Open Your Eyes to a Credit Union National Awareness Campaign. This year's GAC gave us a deeper look at this new national campaign. Currently, our team is coordinating with CUNA on brand messaging platforms that can integrate the CU Link campaign with the national effort. Cube TV is working, our own Cube TV is working on the creative, shooting the commercials, and coming up with the new messages that will integrate with that uh, important national awareness effort. We're proud to be completely synced up now with the CUNA campaign. And if you wonder if you should contribute to that effort, just know that you already are. That's right, by supporting the MCOL CU Link campaign this year, all of our credit unions have, and about half of our credit unions have done more than the minimum. About a third of our credit unions have actually contributed the full fair share. All of those dollars will go into promoting the new uh, Open Your Eyes to a Credit Union campaign here in our Michigan market. Our goal now is to reinforce the reasons why 550 people in Michigan and 10,000 nationally are joining credit union every day. When it comes to consumer and small business financial services, credit unions are the highest value, most trusted offering available. And this is what the CUNA League system is all about, really, being a catalyst for cooperative efforts, whether it be advocacy or funding the promotion of the credit union difference. We expect to hit the media markets this coming spring, starting in April, hopefully, with more than $2.2 million in advertising over a full 12-month cycle. So thank you for your support. Look for more information in the weeks ahead on how you can integrate your own uh, brand into the uh, Open Your Eyes to a Credit Union campaign here in Michigan. You should also know that the MCO board authorized an additional $250,000 to be sent to CUNA to help with the research and the future uh, ad creation to help credit unions nationally as well as in Michigan. We did this on your behalf. Let me talk about the Michigan Credit Union Foundation. March 30th kicks off Money Smart Week, which has been extended to, the, to cover the full month of April. Preschool financial education books will be read and distributed to 8,000 families attending storytime events at public libraries across the state. 68 libraries have teamed up with credit unions to offer supplemental financial education for the youth or for the parents during these events. 
With the goal of helping people build a strong financial future, our foundation is again funding the Enhanced Financial Counseling Certification Training Program. CUNA's Enhanced FICEP Curriculum features webinars and live training sessions, giving staff the ability to guide members and increase their financial understanding. Our foundation funding contributes to lower costs and provides full scholarships to small credit unions. Additionally, the foundation is contributing professional development by providing scholarships to the CUNA Management School this year. Visit uh, the foundation website for more information. Let me shift to education and events for MCL. Last month, uh, we wrapped up a highly successful compliance conference. We're happy to report this year had the highest attendance ever. Nearly 40% of our Michigan credit unions had at least one person register and benefit from the event. We're proud to deliver networking and educational events that showcase up and coming technology, influential speakers, and industry best practices. Our calendar for 2019 is full of professional development opportunities, uh, learnings for volunteers, events like our Lending and Marketing Conference, as well as the Spring and Fall Leadership Development Conferences coming up later this year. And don't forget our Executive Summit in September. We encourage you all to take advantage of these, uh, these great conferences and events put on by our team. And our annual convention, of course, this year is in Detroit. Don't miss that one. That is our big event with lots of opportunities to hear from great speakers, to participate in networking, and uh, much, much more. Shifting to regulatory compliance, our Michigan credit community knows how committed the MCOL and CUNA are to provide a full array of regulatory compliance tools and resources, as well as fee-based consulting services. Our destination compliance resource houses all the resources and tools available for those purposes. They, of course, include the InfoSight product, the Policy Pro Model Policy Library, ComplySight for an affordable compliance auditing tool, and many other resources and tools. We're very excited to be announcing soon that we will also offer a new compliance audit uh, service called Affirmex. Affirmex's uh, platform will provide credit unions with more of a full service compliance audit experience for audit and remediation services. Yes, it will cost more than ComplySite, but for those credit unions who don't have the in-house compliance staff to use the ComplySite tool, this Affirmex product is a great option for satisfying examiner requests, for risk monitoring, and for making sure that your credit union has a top-notch risk management and compliance audit resource. Now, CUSG is working toward finalizing the acquisition of the rights to the Affirmax product suite in the credit union sector, and we hope to have that done by the end of March and, and be offering the Affirmax products in Michigan as soon as May or June. We'll also showcase this new product opportunity at our annual convention. CUSG's technology and marketing divisions continue to keep a pulse on the latest technology trends so that we can deliver cutting edge tools to credit unions. Our LifeSteps Wallet app enables credit unions to meet members' mobile banking expectations by leveraging its one app, Mobile Banking Plus strategy, including a full suite of features that help members with banking, home, auto, and financial wellness decisions. Upcoming developments for the app include single sign-on mobile banking, account aggregation, a credit union-centric P2P solution, updated ATM locator, engaging educational videos, and many other features. CUSU is also exploring partnerships that will help credit unions offer small dollar fractional share investing tools to members, as well as more features for home and auto buying and maintenance. All of these will be uh, available a la carte or as a bundle within the Lifestops Wallet product. Our announced partnership with CU Ledger this last week will also integrate blockchain technology to help provide a more secure authentication process for mobile banking and related services through the LifeSteps wallet. If your credit union is interested in seeing how easily these kinds of solutions can enhance your mobile banking offerings, give us a call or visit our website or contact one of our team members. Our technology team is also working to enhance the content management system interface that drives our web design and hosting services for credit unions. We look for client feedback. We serve over 100 Michigan credit unions among the 400 plus that we serve. And the enhancements to this CMS platform are important and we rely on the feedback from our credit unions for that. 
Moving to our marketing solutions division. Well, it's tax season, obviously, and tax season is nearing its end. And to help our current Love My Credit and Rewards clients, we've posted a late season TurboTax uh, series of assets in our partner center. These marketing materials will help motivate and capture members who haven't yet filed their taxes. And as the IRS reports, we have a relatively high number of late filers this year. So this latest promotional messaging highlights the protection offered when members use TurboTax or the new TurboTax Live consulting service, which is a great add-on. And always up to date on the latest tax laws, TurboTax guarantees 100% accuracy in its calculations. So your members can be confident their taxes are done right and that they will get the largest refund possible uh, brought to them by their credit union, of course. These promotional assets offer a great opportunity for you to speak with members about how to use their tax refund, like opening a share savings account at your credit union and helping plan for the future. They also position your credit union as a trusted resource, encouraging members to return to you for more of their financial questions and needs in that area. Of course, consumers are always looking for deals to save money, not just at tax time. The current Love My Credit Rewards Sprint promotion is a great example of why more and more people are finding their way to a local credit union to take advantage of these incredible offers. Now, I know most credit unions in Michigan have been promoting the Sprint program for many years, but the offer is bigger and better than ever, so we encourage our credit unions to actively help their members take advantage of these cost savings on their uh, wireless services. Beyond the Sprint program, we're working on other offers that can be housed within Love My Credit and Rewards. We're currently in talks with several companies that offer products in the areas of home security, insurance, car maintenance, and more to join the Love My Credit and Rewards uh, credit member discount offerings. If you're not currently taking advantage of Love My Credit and Rewards, uh, now's the time for you to check out a lot of these changes that we're making. Well, our Performance Pro and Compies products continue to be enhanced and integrated. We serve, as you know, over 700 U.S. credit unions. Roughly 50 to 60 of those are here in Michigan. The team is also in the process of incorporating a new learning management system into that performance management platform for our clients. This will enable those credit unions to customize training curriculums for their employees with each performance review and coaching session throughout the year. In addition to being a strong motivating factor for employees, a unique and structured learning plan for professional development is a great way to provide uh, evidence that the credit union wants to help with, with personal and professional development as part of performance management. Now I take a deeper dive into the concept of performance management. Uh, in my latest CEO Connect video, I invite you to take a look at that article in CU Insight as well as the video that we have posted on our website. Finally, our newest division, Strategic Advisory Services, is preparing to introduce a new approach to e-advisory, a digital way of delivering consulting and subject matter expertise remotely. CUSG's e-advisory services will include digitally delivered consulting modules such as webinars and white papers that will be available to credit unions. The purpose of these modules is to expand the reach of consulting services to make them more affordable to credit unions of all sizes. Also, those of you who attended the MCL Compliance Conference know that our CUSG Strategic Advisory Services is rolling out a marijuana-related or cannabis-related business analysis. Available to Michigan credit unions, this data scrub service will help financial institutions draw attention to potential exposure from cannabis-related uh, banking. Credit unions interested in this service should reach out to our staff. And I also want to put a plug in for CUSG's Planning Pro product as you start to think about your revised strategic plans. Planning Pro will help you with the process as well as the plan metric tracking. But we also have great consultants who can facilitate your planning as well. And finally, look for our new governance policy product, Governance, in the coming months. Similarly, both the product, the Library of Governance Policies, and the associated consulting services can help you and your boards be where they need to be in terms of effective governance. Well, thank you for watching this month's edition of the Priority Report. You know our mission is to help credit unions serve, grow, and remain strong, and we're proud of the impact credit unions have in their communities and in serving their members. If you have any questions about anything that we covered in this edition, feel free to give me a call or email me or contact uh, one of our staff. Thanks for listening.